I pooped my pants at work and ate my underwear inside a box that was shipped to a customer. That was shipped to a customer. No! Hello everyone, it's your girl boys again and I'm back with another video. So you all, this video isn't like a planned content, a scripted content, a scripted video, whatever. Because honestly, I was thinking of the content to create and nothing came to my mind. So I was like, okay, why don't I do some amiibo with you? So um, we are going to be reading some confessions, reacting to some confessions. And these confessions, eh, I have not seen any one of them and I haven't even checked for any one of them. So we are going to be checking for them together and you all please, I just hope this thing goes up because if I'm going to see you try confessions here, yeah, just be fixing guy. Uh, but these things without like and everything, it's just okay. Oh, okay. So I think I've seen some confessions you guys um I ate dog food just to see what it tasted like. No, no, no. The first thing I want to ask is why are people behaving? I feel like it's kind of okay to be curious about something. But like, it is not possible for the curiosity to enter the level of tasting your dog's food. Just think about it. Like, I would say that I'm a curious person, but like, I'm not like a very curious person that a kill. I would literally do things that are really risky just because I want to know what it feels like, just because I want to know what it seems like. Because this is this is very risky. Have you guys, please, you guys should put it down in the comment section. Have you by mistake ever eaten your dog's food? Well, well I would I won't say this is like overly weird because people are curious and people tend to do crazy things when they are curious. So when I sleep with stuffed animals, I make sure their heads are above the blanket so they can breathe. I don't understand, like, the things that people do, people would not do, like, things that they know that, okay, well, this thing is very weird, and people will obviously judge me. I get to the office an hour ago before my boss, at least once a week, for the last two years. I've been peeing a little bit into his, <laughs> into his coffee mug. Oh my god, you guys. When he fills up in the morning, I have never seen him raise it out. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? I rebuke me from a bad person in our life. Say amen over there. But obviously, like, this person might, this particular boss might, like, be like somebody that is not a good person or a nice person. Because some people, if they are in a certain position, like, higher than others, they take advantage of it and then treat people like trash, treat people under them like trash. <clears throat> it's been a long time since I had a crush on him. Okay. One night I was drunk and texted her and told her how much I like her. She replied with L M F. -D. <laughs> you guys, you guys. I feel like people are violent because imagine you really like somebody and then you don't say okay let me just go and tell this person how I feel and they reply with me for oh I feel bad for this girl I mean this guy so um <clears throat> our neighborhood has a Facebook page when I discover parents that don't vaccinate their children I tell my wife not to invite them over to play. But sorry, how is this correlating with the fact that your neighbor would as a Facebook page? Sometimes I'm not sorry, sorry, but like I understand the joke, I understand the confession, I understand the funny confession. But like if you are saying something that is let's correlate with each other. So either way, uh, let's move on to the next one. The person just killed the vibe and the energy. My traveling bag is always lent to friends when they travel overseas. I can't afford to actually to go. At least my bag is available too. Well, this this person doesn't have a point. 
my campus forever like it's if this is meant to be a joke then the joke is true no offense I am a successful female scientist and feminist. All I want in the world is to get married and have kids. Uh, like this is actually really, really touching. Wait, is it touching? It's not touching, but it's giving uh, because like it is everybody's dream is very different. But like this particular person dream is very nice. She says she is a successful female scientist and feminist. She has gotten what she wants, career-wise, money-wise, for her to stay successful. But she hasn't like gotten one of the things that actually brings her happiness, which is family. I honestly just told people, there are some things in your life that wouldn't work as you expect it to. And if you keep on thinking and thinking, there's nothing that can actually happen or change. So one thing that I always tell people, even people that are very close to me knows, is just talk to God about it. Honestly, there's nothing God can do. So, so I'm just like saying, obviously, the person that already is not what you do. But I'm just saying is that obviously there are things that we in our life we haven't gone to, and God has a reason for everything. Number one, and everybody's journey is different. Number two, and number three, just comes into God's hands because there's no amount of thinking that can solve the problem. I ate our bed, therefore I asked our cats to pee on it so that my husband could buy a new. Bed. Like, honestly, you could have just told him to get another one. Well, well, you see, it is people that make people to do some crazy things. Because there's a probability that if this lady, eh, if she had gone to meet her husband, it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't change this for her. But either way, this is like a very crazy thing to do. Like, this is, you know, people, people just tend to do things that you would never actually even think of doing. But yeah, like I said earlier, people are crazy, so I feel like there are a lot of things that people do that shouldn't even surprise me anymore. One time, I pooped my pant at work and hid my underwear inside a box that was shipped to a customer. Oh my god! What? I want you to always put this in the comment section. Or oh, what would you, what would you do? Because honestly, personally, I would be irritated. I wouldn't even use whether it's clothes, whether it's food, whether it's hair, especially whether it's anything. I'm not going to make you do that thing. And thirdly, you see that company or whatever that place is, they are not going to be for Because I'm going to buy a serious company and I'm going to post it online so that people know that this is how they are doing this. Doing this type of thing is, is just like bringing down the rate of that brand. I don't know what would take a normal person to, okay, you put your pants at work. I'm not trying to blame you. Maybe something's wrong with you. But like, you could have looked for something else to do. Why put it inside? Please, are you even thinking, like, if it was you that that happened, if... Uh, I don't even know why I'm taking this thing person. No, I'm taking this thing best now. But like, let's just move to the next one because this is just so nasty. Like, please, in case you have it, do you have it? Like, you have this thing in mind to ever do? Please don't even try it. Please, I beg you. Because what is this? Please. It's like the frame keeps on changing, and I'm sorry, you guys, for any inconvenience. But it... okay, so we're going to be reading another confession. You guys will soon be editing this video, this video because this video, the um comments that I've been, sorry the confessions that I've been reading earlier has brought out enough reaction for me and, and I guess I'm tired of reacting because I'm getting choked up. I'm getting tired. <laughs> Never to be caught on fresh. Okay so another confession is the local delivery guy has a crush on me. So I order all kinds of stuff just to say oh look at this oh, video <laughs> I started six weeks ago when I had ordered a new electric fan and he delivered it. Uh, he has a crush on you. Not that he has a crush on you. So. Wait, wait what's be I'll say is that, that because you get money, you have money to live, that's why. Because why would, you wouldn't need something, you just keep on ordering things just so that you can see somebody that has a crush on you, not somebody that you have a crush on. This is a type of situation where you're like, 
Think about think your about life. life. Because you actually have to think about your life. I don't know. People just have a lot of money to waste. Please, in case you have money, you have plenty of money to waste. Waste it on me, yeah. Because even though, see, even though I'm in this girl's shoe and I have a crush, even though the girl does not have a crush on me, and I have a crush on him, I am not going to other things just for him to call and deliver because I have a crush on him. They play. Growing up, I couldn't have a pet, so I filled a plastic bag with water and pretended it was mine. Mm. I made a little nest in my texture and hold it and pet. Mm. You guys, this is so cute. The question is, why couldn't this person have a pet? Well, different family, different reasons, and things like that. But like, this is so cute, honestly. Like. I can imagine this person, like just imagine like a six year old child, number seven or five or four, filling a plastic bag with water and petting it. That was actually very really cute. I feel like if if I'm older and I have a child and I see that child doing that, I would literally feel like crying and be like, mm -mm. just name whatever you want, just name the pet, I'm going to give it to you. But it seems that me, I'm not a pet fan. Because I don't like dog, I don't like puppy. In short, I don't like anything. You see, animals, the word animals, I don't like it. That's why I don't move with animals. <laughs> but I like to play on his head. Okay. So, as I was saying, like, you know, some people are so crazy that they keep even lying as their pets. <laughs> You guys, we have come to the end of the video because that's basically everything that I can read, honestly. And if you guys want impact, so just tell me. And honestly, these confessions are some of them are funny, some of them are weird, some of them are strange. Like, literally, almost literally almost everything are weird. I'm not even going to lie. But either ways, um, I hope you all enjoyed this video because I'm not even going to lie. I enjoyed filming this video. I'm not going to lie. So, yeah, don't forget to like, share it to your friends. Subscribe and click on the description button so that every time I drop this content, you know what I'm saying? You guys are going to be notified. So, yeah, I'm going to see you guys in my next video. So, yeah, bye.